Hello everyone and welcome back to Bitcoin Tips. So today we've got some really exciting news. We're going to be taking a look at the brand new released Shiba Swap. So before we get into the video today, I do want to make sure to ask you to hit the like button to help out the YouTube algorithm in recommending this video for more people so more people can learn about what's going to be coming for Shiba and how to just make money online overall. So let's get into the video today. So like I said, I'm going to be talking about this uh, newly released Shiba Swap and going over some of the features that it has and what you can do on it. So if you're not familiar with Shiba Inu, it's basically a fairly new cryptocurrency. It's coming up on its one-year anniversary based around the Shiba Inu dog, uh, which of course is the same face that everybody knows from Dogecoin. Now, a lot of people think that Shiba uh, or Shiba Inu, Sheep, whatever you want to refer to it as, was created uh, as a cheap, you know, try and be just like Dogecoin coin after Dogecoin went up like crazy earlier this year. But like I said, Shiba was released back in August of last year, 2020. Um, and, you know, it's been around for a little while. And of course, Dogecoin going up did help bring up the price of this coin as well. But they've released this new site called Shiba Swap early this morning. Um, so we've known it's coming for a while, but we haven't known a specific date. So we're just going to be looking around some of the things that you can do with it. And, you know, what I think will be coming for Shiba Inu and the price of it in the future. So going to shibaswap.com, you'll see a screen that looks just like this, and you have a Connect wallet up here. You can connect your MetaMask, Wallet Connect, or Coinbase wallet to the site. Right now, I don't have anything connected um, as it is still very new, but I will probably be using MetaMask uh, if I was going to connect one. I do have the MetaMask extension up here. If you guys are interested in a tutorial of that, let me know down below. But basically, there's going to be a few different ways that you can earn some more cryptocurrency on here. The first one is going to be Dig. It says there are tons of bones under the ground. Provide liquidity to earn bone. So if we click on this here, um, you can create a pair for um, earning extra money through bone. Um, so, you know, dig, there's a bunch of bones underground. You're going to be earning their bone coin, which right now is priced at about $16.39. So by adding liquidity, you have to, um, you know, swap from Ethereum into your, you know, the token that you want to use. So using the swap, um, so, you know, clicking here to read more about it in order to claim your dig rewards, which we'll get back to in just a second here, you must deposit your SSLP, which is Shiba Swap Liquidity Provider Tokens, into the associated pair box at Wolf. Once SSLP tokens are deposited, your returns are accrued in real time. You can claim 33% of the Wolf returns weekly, but the remaining 67% will be time locked for six months. So it is a little confusing when you first start here because you have dig um, here, which is how you you know you can start with you know going through here, adding liquidity, and then you read a little bit more about it. Um, so you have to deposit um, to earn using your Shiba Swap liquidity provider tokens. Now, if we go back real quick before we go further into that, you can see we also have a fetch and a bury section. Um, going into the fetch section here, you can see this has more to do with that um, migration from Uniswap liquidity into um, your your coins here on ShibaSwap, which is really cool. Um, so that's something, again, once you have a wallet connected, it would make a little bit more sense here. But you can also do this same thing for SushiSwap, which are a couple other swapping exchange sites um, that are out there and have been around for a little bit longer. Um, those names are probably a lot more familiar. Now, Barry, this is, I think, where a lot of people, you know, if you're watching this video, this is probably going to be what I would do on the site. You know, the dig and the fetch are cool, but this is probably what I would be doing overall. Um, so you can stake your Shiba. Um, so Shibas love to bury what they find. Basically, bury hold it for later and then you can unbury it later but uh, it allows you to stake tokens to earn wolf rewards proportionally to the contribution to the pool when you stake either shiba leash or bone you will receive x shiba x leash or t-bone these tokens represent your share of the pool. Wolf returns are distributed weekly. So if you're starting to catch on to the, the theme here, we have the wolf, uh, which is going to be what you're going to earn over time through the different liquidities, 
staking, burying, digging, stuff like that. So, um, you know, the longer you leave them staked, the better. And then, of course, you're going to be earning 33% of your overall wolf returns weekly, but then after six months, you will earn the rest of it. That's to just help keep the price up over time. So the staking and earning there, I think, is what a lot of people are going to do. Um, of course, there's the Shiba swap, which, again, you can swap tokens, you know, just like normal, or you can swap into those SSLP tokens. Um, and then we have the bone folio Shiba Inu needs to check their stash that is coming soon. But, you know, based off that, my guess is you're going to be able to enter in coins that you have. It's basically going to be kind of like a wallet that allows you to track your holdings and then Wolf, your returns. This is where you would, um, you know, come here to claim what you have earned. And then also you have your, um, returns that you can claim over here. You can add liquidity to these different um, pairs and stuff like that here. So this is where it starts to make a little bit more sense with what you had to do. You know, by adding liquidity, this is where you would input bone um, or, you know, swap it from bone to Ethereum or Ethereum to bone. And then you can go back to this section here and add it as liquidity to these pairs. So Shiba swap is, you know, just over about 12 to 16 hours old. And there's already, as you can see here, $690 million locked on the site. That is an incredible amount of money. Now, of course, there are bone and leash tokens as well, not just Shiba, but that's still a huge amount of money. And I think that's going to just grow over time. Earlier today, just a few hours ago, it was in the 500, so it has gone up over 100 million since I last saw it. This has a lot of potential to bring the price of Shiba as well as Leash and Bone up very slowly over time. I don't think we're going to see a huge, quick spike. That would be more something like adding uh, you know, Shiba to Coinbase or another major exchange. But over time, as more people start burying Shiba, start using the dig and fetch features to earn wolf, we're going to start to see the price of this slowly go up. So right now, I would say is the best time to buy Shiba, the best time to mine Shiba, and just collect it while it's cheap. Because once it starts going up, you're going to wish that you were able to get it at this, you know, 86, 98 level or, you know, something like that. So... If you're interested in ShibaSwap, check it out at ShibaSwap.com. If you have Shiba, check out the berry feature at the at the you know very least, because then you're earning some extra cryptocurrencies. You're gonna earn three or four currencies just for using the site, which is super cool. But if you like this video, leave a like. If you didn't, you know what to do. And if you have any questions or comments, leave a comment down below or check out the Discord at the link in the description below. So please like, share, and subscribe to my Bitcoin Tips YouTube channel to learn more about spending, collecting, earning, and investing different types of cryptocurrencies. I hope you enjoyed, and I hope to see you in my next video. Bye.